Hi, my name is Sarah Cruz. I'm a member of the Rapid Response Network. And the Rapid Response Network connects people uh, to lend solidarity to workers' struggles against repression and exploitation. And the network also aims to lend this solidarity directly to workers and to do that based on their interests under their guidance. The Rapid Response Network is also a project of One Struggle. One Struggle is an anti-capitalist, anti-imperialist collective, but members of the Rapid Response Network don't necessarily have to share those same views. Uh, we all get together and unify around supporting workers' struggles. Uh, so one more organization to mention is Bataille Ouvrier, which means workers fight in English, it is an autonomous workers' organization in Haiti. They have been organizing for better living conditions and also around the issue of the minimum wage. And they've also been able to organize uh, trade unions all across the country. The conditions for Haitian garment workers are among the most abusive and harsh in the world. They receive the industry's lowest wages in the Western Hemisphere at 200 goods, or less than $5 a day. The legal minimum wage is actually 300 good, about $6.90 a day. But a recent report issued by the Workers' Rights Consortium shows that factory owners refuse to pay even this inadequate minimum wage. Now, after 25 years of delay and ongoing wage theft, the State Salary Council of Haiti is going to announce a new minimum wage on November 29th. We cannot send our kids to school. Whatever they give us, we have to pay transportation. We cannot even do anything with the salary. We start work at 6 o'clock. We finish at 5, and the quota is huge and big. They, are not, they have no intent to pay us. We don't even have time to eat because we cannot meet the quota. They are not thinking about us, they are, they are thinking about their own interests. With the wage increase on November 29th, Bataille Vrier is mobilizing around the country and they need your support. Each trade union will be having general assemblies, trainings, rallies, and protests against abuses and violations of workers' rights, including arbitrary firings, beatings, and harassment. This is where you come in. All of these activities need funding, so your contributions will go towards making all of these organizing efforts possible and will also help recoup costs of transportation, phone calls, ink, paper, printing leaflets. Whatever, whatever that con the, the product that comes, the pair of pants, the t-shirt, we are the one producing it. We, we labor hard and we don't get paid. Today we are happy that we have foreigners that are able to listen to us and hear us so they could give us the, their support. Workers' struggles for decent wages, working conditions, plus the right to organize are constantly met with severe punishment. Funding this Indiegogo campaign is one way that you can actively support these workers. You can also join the Rapid Response Network for support in organizing your own protests, pickets, actions, and make sure you like the Rapid Response Network on Facebook to keep up with everything that's going on in the struggle for the Haitian minimum wage. Thank you so much for your support.